Hi, welcome to this general introduction to SWeb for uh, the Deal Team. Kate Walworth and the Deal Team. Hi, guys. Okay, so we're just going back in history. SWeb started with this website in 2002, katevillas.com, which generally pays the bills. Um, then in 2009, I saw I made a new website called Experience Africa, and uh, I did a deal with Sotheby's Cape Town. They would have a copy of the site, that copy of the site. They would then go make money. We would have a commission. But the developers in 2009 didn't really do a good job, and it was buggy, so it never really got off the ground. And really, it's taken another 10 years to get it to to the launch point. Um, 2013 created the first duplicate of Cape Villas. Cape Villas, this site was exactly duplicated and came to Cape Town Luxury Villas, which went on to make nearly as much money in 2015 as Cape Villas did. So it really showed this duplicate website can work. You don't have to have a 20 year business history. The clients don't seem to mind that much. Okay. One second, just going to have a sip of water. Okay, from... Then I got this website, Cape Town Luxury Villas, which is a copy of Cape Villas, and I then turned it into villasecrets.com, albeit the original version wasn't quite this pretty. This is 2017. Then, because, uh, because of a number of reasons, we had to copy this onto capevillas.com, and now it's gone full circle. It started as Cape Villas, it turned into Cape Town Luxury Villas, it turned into Villa Secrets, now it's back as Cape Villas. And now it is the portfolio piece. Uh, gonna show some of the search functions. And you can use this if you wish to add a, uh, a middle page prompt that's what it is there for so clicking on search this would think of this not as villas think of this as a uh, little uh, way where you write about your blogs if you've got a photograph for each blog that'd be wonderful and um, think of uh, the title of the blog can automatically go here we could have the name of the person who wrote it the date you can have more information here and um, as you uh, go through, if you click on, so let's just go back to that page. I want to show you it as it goes down because it's quite pretty. Come in like that. So that's a nice little feature. Okay, so where have we, we've gone to here. This is now a individual villa page. At the top, it's got a big slider doesn't have to have this these choices are up to you then we have a text section then we have some details and all of these sections like this like this uh, become options for you to choose when you are making a blog you uh, as you go down you do the next section you uh, you choose whatever section you want next these are all sections okay also, this is a good way to present a blog. Let's uh, move forward a little bit. Oh, uh, yeah. Now we're going to talk about um, donor economic site and the navigation. Currently, we have this. I'm not sure what the new idea is, um, but uh, we can get this quite easily in here. Um, we can have things this is a nice feature because it's actually I, it starts here but I chose to keep it open you add more so you can have things like this so your data becomes uh, search requirements and um, you know there's these options here these you can have a number of, these you can have a number of, plus you've got these options at the top. So there's certainly enough options to show that all that you want there and, and a lot more on top. Let's just go forwards. 
Ah, uh, yeah, we're seeing an individual page here. Now, ah, this is an automatically made page. This, all this information you see here comes from a, what's called a P uh, PMS, a property management system. Um, they feed us the data, including availability, all, everything you see on this page is automatically made. Just all we need is the connection. So imagine you can, instead of this, you have maybe some feed from Minsky. You have some feed from the World Bank, from Ox, you know, whatever feeds you need, uh, including pictures. Um, it's it, These companies generally always have a pretty good API, which means we can get that information pretty easily. Uh, hours, not days. Um, yeah, so that, this is an example of what we can do automatically. So you can have the equivalent of this um, automatically coming in whenever the data changes. Okay, now we're going to Cape Town, sorry, CapeLuxuryVillas.com. This is a copy of um, Cape Villas. But this time, instead of making a copy and working on this one, this becomes a new website for other people to have. Maybe it's luxury retreats. We certainly would like to see them. Um, but also, as a part of a collection of maybe eight or maybe more sites that we want to, uh, we want one of the top five real estate companies in Cape Town uh, taking on, making a, uh, making a network, building that network, you know, eventually to 64 um potentially with joining with other networks to make a network of 512 and here we see another new website that we've made villasincampsbay.com this would do well in adwords and um yeah we're looking for a home for this one this could be a home for a uh, an estate agent who's knows a lot of people who have villas and they're willing to rent them they just do some deals, get, you know, uh, use this website to help them get that website, that those mandates. Now we're on the edit page. The edit page is cool because it looks like the real page. I don't think anyone else, well, I haven't seen anyone else. They make the pages, it add, everyone else, you add a little bit here, you got to add this bit, you got to add that bit, you got this, this, got to add that. Here you can just go, oh, you know, I don't want to see those there. Yeah, yeah, I want to add them. Etc, etc. You can change the pictures, add CEO, SEO information, and so on. Here is a site we've done in WordPress that um, we're welcome to again <laughs> duplicate and change the content for you if, if if WordPress is your preferred choice. It's it's just not that good at connecting to APIs. That's the that's the that's the downside of WordPress. But anyway, we can see angeltheory.org, and here you know we've got web, uh, many many different subjects and each subject can have its own you know set yeah so there you've got the top menu you've got a drop down you've got that drop down being seen as a left side and then you've got another so there look you see how much information you can get there however I prefer our choices up here um, and again the advanced search here this is Experience Africa, so we finally made it. Uh, this was made about a week and a half ago, and it really was 10 years in the making. Um, I need to make it uh, a little bit more pretty. Um, there's, you know, there's this going on, and I want to go there. And I want to customize this. But yeah, we made it. We made it. Finally made it. Okay, so in terms of the uh, whatever website we make for um, Dada Economics, 
Uh, maybe it is done at economics.org. Um, the satellite sites that we make, i.e. we have capevillas.com and we have satellite sites, Cape Luxury Villas, satellite site Villas in Cairns Bay. So potentially people here or people from the university or, you, you know, you've mentioned many different groups. They can have their satellite sites. They then work with that satellite site. They become the... Uh, it becomes theirs essentially they do their what they do but all the info that they put on their site is also put on the mother site so you can you you can actually pick and choose actually you maybe go oh okay i want this bit i don't want that bit i want this cut this this page on yeah you know something like that so all of these people here are potentially website owners And again, just finally, uh, navigation. We can we can handle that quite easily. If you want this section to the right, you can have it. We used to have it. We got rid of it. Um, but you know, that's 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 your call. If you want a right sidebar, you can have a right sidebar. Okay, so there we go. Um, Look, I really want to do this. The reason I really want to do this is because it, it shows, it lets me do something outside of uh, Villas that I can show as an example for sweb.org. It's also convenient because I don't actually have the money to pay for my developers for the next three or four months. Um, so, I, 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 as always, for the last 10 years, I, I work for free, but my developers... Um, that 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 cost can be paid for within that three thousand three hundred and thirty-three a month. Um, yeah, I mean, I really, I really would love to do this. I th I think once I've done this, uh, then then it's on to uh, then it's on to the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation and uh, the Chan Zuckerberg Foundation, etc. Um, last thing I suppose is in doing this. I am happy to give you equity in SWeb UK, um, or even whatever SWeb UK's continental network will be. Um, so, when it gets sold, or when it becomes a very, very big thing, we want it to work for Facebook and Facebook business. We want it to work. We want Twitter business people given the option to use it. Uh, we want LinkedIn people given the option to use these systems and sweb is how we build that website in the first place there's an awful lot of software that's under the bonnet but we're not going to talk about that now now we're just talking about making that initial site and its satellites and uh, again i'll say look I, you know this is i want to do this um so you know and i will do it well you know you'll you'll have a site that people will think cost millions and when you get loads of them because we can make loads of them you start looking like a big operation you get the google grants ten thousand dollars per month for each satellite if they're a non-profit you know suddenly we've got a million dollars worth of advertising behind us for free and loads of science and it's just this is what you need please <laughs> please please go for this option it would make me very happy and i think you would get a really much better system than you can even possibly think of in a short time okay thanks kate and thanks everybody else lizzie cheers